This is Nobody's Movie Review Podcast. Hi. In Bryant Park, once again. I like the park vibe because it's nice and I don't have to pay for a spot. Yeah. <laughs> I like this. This, this is good because now I can see that way. So I can see I can see all of... All the stores? Fifth Avenue. Is These stores over here are pointless. Oh, it is Fifth Ave. This yeah. is stores the block where pointless. I don't have enough money to buy some of yeah, majority of these stores on this Look, block. I'm looking directly at G Star. I don't know. I don't know if I should move this. Back. Mo- Muji is seventy percent off. So Muji is, is a that, is waste that, of a store. Can somebody? Sh- what is I just, Muji? I just went in what there and it's just waste. It looks what is like, Muji? From here, it looks like a shoe store. Is it a shoe store? It's not a shoe store. It's like <laughs> all bunch of like. Oh, you bought water. You want a water? I didn't know you bought water. I had wine, but I have no wine opener. You have a wine opener in your bag? No, you didn't tell me to I'm bring surprised. it. I would have bought it. I, f- I figured you always had one. There's a way to do something to pop a cork. You know With that, right? With a lighter. What? You could set it on fire. Damn, I don't have my lighter either. Yeah, well, I got to see that. I got to see how you do So it. we watched we watched uh, three I movies. I did not watch one movie. You didn't watch any of them? Oh, well, you, you'd already seen I cut it off. What? You'd already seen I Am Mother. You already saw 46. I saw all these movies. Yeah. Uh-huh. And I forgot how bad Natural Born Killers is. <laughs> it's not bad. It is terrible. Let's start bro. with that one. Can we just talk about how this fucking bee just came up no, on me? It's fine. Yeah. Maybe I'm in bright colors. I'm just being attacked all weekend. <laughs> Natural Born Killers is trash. No, it's not. It's a good Yo, movie. No, it's trash, bro. Well, all right, let's talk about it. Let's, get, let's start with that. It's yeah, too much. Yeah, can you guys start well, with it's that? It's not much. It's too much. How? Because it's, the start is okay, okay, cool. They're in a diner, yeah. all that stuff. But then it's just too much. What, what's too much about it? It's her killing her parents. Yeah. It's too much. How is that too much? It just it happened. It's too much. It's just, I cut it off. Bro. People really do kill their parents, though. No, but like the way it's shot is very annoying. <laughs> it, it, it shot it's very shot annoying. It's shot weird. <laughs> it's shot it's actually, very annoying. It's, 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 it's Probably the most different of any Oliver Stone movie. It's the ever. most annoying movie I've ever seen. No, it is more, no, more annoying movies than that. No, that movie is very nah. fucking annoying. So, bro. all right, let's let's get through it real quick. All right, so Mickey Just, and Mallory in the uh-huh. beginning, they're in the diner. They talk. Uh, I cut it off. I tell you. At that point, you cut it off. No, no, no. It's so Where, funny point, that. How far did you get before you cut it off? The cop, the, they were killing cops. Like okay. he was at. They were talk, the cop was telling the story about them. The cop wasn't tell- Well, he's telling the story about two people. That was like the first five dude. minutes. No, no. Can I just say it. how it's so funny that Mick and Mallory start in a diner and then you think of Pulp Fiction yeah. and how... Yeah, but that's... Yeah. that's Pulp, Pulp Fiction, 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 Fiction is... Yeah. Uh, Pulp Fiction is a better movie. Tarantino wrote... Uh, where he wrote, this um, movie is just shot so annoying. I can't. I can't watch it. Okay. I, I get what you're saying. There's, I, I understand. I can't, like, there's, like, there's, I can't the watch scene, it like that. The scene in the hotel... Where like the window is just what he's seeing on TV. Yeah. Yeah, like the whole the whole thing is like an acid trip. Yeah, not even like. No. I've never taken acid, so I don't know. Actually, it's not like an acid trip. I've never taken acid. So it's I don't like know. fucking. I wouldn't know either. So, you know what? Guy. It's oh, wow, this shit crazy. It's I like the know. worst this part. Is, this it's like the worst cool. part of an acid trip. Like there was a part when I was on acid, and I had to, and I took a shower. Yeah. And it was scary <laughs> as shit. <laughs> this is like taking a shower on acid. <laughs> okay. Um, That's so go ahead. Get so yeah, the so there, the, so it's 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 shot similar to a Tarantino movie, but he because he wrote it. But uh, Oliver Stone took some chances with it. Um, it's too much. The so sitcom Mickey, shit is stupid. The what? When they like played it like a sitcom. So I thought and he's of, like talking crazy. Yeah, and I like, thought about that. Is... That's that's because Mallory is insane. Mallory's crazy. Here's the thing. Everything we're seeing is from their perspective. Yeah. Like, Mallory's crazy, so she has to justify having an abusive, uh, sexually abusive father by making it a sitcom in her head. That's all it is. Hmm. Yeah, but the, the it, entire movie is like that. Yeah, but that's why. I don't, I don't like Because they're talking I, about. some sick shit, and it's like sick. It's just like, I can't. Yeah, it's a fucked up movie. Well, give yeah, them the synopsis so, of it. So, uh, Mickey, uh, Mickey and Mallory in a diner. Uh, these rednecks walk in. Are they coming down this way? Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, the, the, these rednecks walk in, and Mallory, who's played by Juliette Lewis, she's uh, she's dancing to, to, to music on the jukebox. They're being weird. Mickey orders key lime pie, which didn't look <laughs> like... like jello. Yeah, it looked like jello on pie crust. Um, <laughs> so... Uh, There's a bird, a flock of, fl- flock of birds feeding. over us. Yeah. So somebody, the uh, one, of the, one of the rednecks... Uh, 
he says something to Mallory, like disrespecting her or whatever. And again, that's why it's shot that way, because like the, 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 all the parts where like the guy is like, like pretending to hump her and like lick her butt and all that, that's like that's what Mickey sees. Yeah. He's like, oh, he, they're being disrespectful, but to another level yeah. in his eyes. So uh, they kill almost everybody in the diner, and their their calling card for as mass murderers is that they leave one person alive. So she goes. She goes to pick somebody to keep alive. She's like, eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and all that stuff. Yeah. So kill they, the kill, they, they kill the girl. And you don't have to go through all that. Right. Just go through the, like, the movie. So uh, the, the, the next thing is uh, them telling the story of how they met, which is what you talk about, the sit-down yeah, yeah. thing. Um, he comes in with a bag of meat. Yeah, he comes in with a bag oh, of meat, and he cut, like she's underage, and he goes yeah, to Yeah, so then they kill, this is yada, yada, they, yeah, kill, they kill her they, parents. They kill, they kill her parents. No, no, no. No, no, no. That was after. Yeah. He, they... They leave together in the father's car, and he gets arrested. Mickey gets arrested for Grand Theft Auto. Okay. So then he escapes from jail because there's a tornado. He comes back, and they kill, that's when they kill the parents. Then they're on a bridge. They they propose. They they, they get married, uh, and then that's when you kind of you kind of see some of the other characters. Robert Downey Jr. is great in the movie. He doesn't. Australian. I didn't even get to Robert Downey. Jr. What? He does an Australian. He does an Australian accent the entire movie. It's great. He plays like this. This the, TV. Yo, the movie is shot terribly, bro. No, it's not. It's not shot terribly. It's just shot weird. It's shot so terribly. It's different. Maybe so, that was the point. I so, know. Uh, it's the Robert point. Downey Jr. plays like but this that TV. That threw me off for the movie. Robert Downey Jr. plays like this TV tabloid reporter, and Tom Sizemore plays like the detective going after him. But he's crazy too. Yeah. So like, uh, there's a scene where he goes and meets this prostitute, and he kills her by choking her to death. But meanwhile, he's like after these guys, and like he's like. All this anger, he's like, I'll, I'll, I'll get you, Mickey and Mallory. It's like, it's They're like a bad Rocco's Modern Life. <laughs> like, you know, shit. they made yeah. a Mo- Rocco's Modern Life movie. I heard about that. It came yeah, out, it, came it just recently. came out on Netflix. Nah, it came out. It's a yeah. movie. It's yeah. a movie. Really? I started like to watch trans, it with Tina. I thought trans it was. Character. I thought it was a. I thought it was another like show. Like they just rebooted no, the show. No, it was forty-five minutes. Oh okay. I heard it. I heard it was good. Um, but I, yeah, see, yeah, it's kind of, kind of like it is, with like I, I know what you mean. All right. So, so I could do it. In, I could deal with it in a cartoon, but in a movie sense, it's like, okay, too much. It's too much for me. So uh, after that, uh, they they uh, they're they're on the run, and they meet this uh, this Native American dude that's gonna that's gonna help them out, and um, and uh, the, uh, I think was it before or after? I can't remember if it was before or after, but at some point, no, no, no it was after. Okay. So they're with the they're with the Native American guy, and he's like, uh, Mickey is like, having these like weird dreams about his own childhood and how his parents were abusive and all that, and he wakes up, he sees the Native American dude and like gets gets scared and shoots him, which is the first part of the movie where they kill somebody and they feel guilty about it. Mm. So they they leave the the Indian guy, and they're walking through the he's desert. Gonna ask for some damn water. They get they're walking oh, through the. You want water? <laughs> it's too late now. Sorry. They're walking through the desert and they get they get <laughs> uh, they get bit by they get bit by rattlesnakes, so they they then now they're they like they they've got like snake venom in their blood and they, they get to a, a drugstore they're trying to find you know like snake antidote antidote for snake venom uh, they can't find any um, the guy the pharmacist realizes who they are because he's got the news on okay. and Mickey's like well I gotta kill you. And he's like, no, 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 you always keep one person alive. He's like, that's what the cameras are for. Pop, kills him. So they go to another drugstore. And at this point, cops find out where they are. They, they, like, they beat the shit out of both of them. And the next thing is one year later. They're in solitary confinement, in jail. And I think the plan was to put them on death row. But Robert Downey Jr.'s character agree, like, lets them, has them agree uh, has Mallory agreed to do one last um, TV interview? Okay. So uh, the uh, the warden tells the detective that killed the prostitute that caught them, he's like, on your way, kill them. And he's like, yeah, no problem. So they're on their way, and then uh, they go to Mickey first. Mickey, uh, Mickey fights his way out, grabs one of the guard shotguns, and he uh, he shoots a bunch of the guards, and that, then that starts a riot okay. uh, in the prison. So fucking prisoners are going nuts. The inmates are going nuts. They're they're fighting all the guards. Like uh, Mallory, 
manages to uh, grab a shiv, mm -hmm. slit the detective's throat, and like they're fucking, they kill the, the TV reporters, uh, all of his crew, and then uh, Robert Downey Jr. character, he like he has like he snaps and he has like Stockholm syndrome now, and so he's like, I'll come with you, wow. like I want to kill too, and like they're, they're, they're fucking mass hysteria breaks out, and they they, mm -hmm. they, escape, they eventually escape the prison, so now they're 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 on the run, they escape the cops and the guards, and they get to a point where. Uh, they did, like Mickey and Mallory decide they're gonna kill Robert Downey Jr. And he's like, no, 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 I'm with you guys. You can't kill me. Like, you gotta keep one person alive. It's your calling card. It's your trademark. You gotta do that. And Mickey's like, there's, we, we left. There's, there's plenty of people around. There's a camera right here still rolling. Mm -hmm. they sh and then he, uh, Robert Downey Jr. is like, all right. He accepts his fate. Puts his arms out like he's on a cross, and they shoot him. At the same time, there's a guy. A producer who's got who's listening to the whole thing in his earpiece, and then they get away like Bonnie and Clyde style, and then the movie ends uh, with I think Mallory's pregnant and they're on the run. They live on like a farm or some shit. And the end was kind of weird, but that's that's that's, uh, that's Natural Born Killers. Farm. I don't know if it was a farm. It was like they were like she's this pregnant. It was like two nobodies, bro. Yeah. <laughs> nah, it's better than that. It's a good movie. I didn't I didn't do it justice. You gotta watch it. Uh, I did. You you cut it off after like ten minutes. No, I cut it off after a while. I've seen it before, anywhere. though. I've seen it before. He's seen yeah. it before. A long time ago. I don't think yeah. I, I don't think I wanted to. It's one of my favorite movies. Yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. That's crazy. Like I saw that. Nah, How old was I when I saw? I might have been twelve. You really when I saw got that? good taste on one in movies. I can't believe. The, why is this your favorite movie? It's not my favorite movie. It's one of my favorites. It's, it's a good. It's like I, I always, I saw it's, when I was it's like. It's a good movie, but it's like. It's weird. I know that so, for it's sure. Too weird, too weird. Majority of his films are shot di weird like, though. But that's the thing; it's not a Tarantino. It's not Tarantino well, shot. Wait, hold on. It was so Oliver who, Stone. What, what other movies? Well, maybe shot? they had two. In Oliver Stone movie. is the same guy that did like uh, what's the fuck? What's the football movie with Jamie Fox? Any given Any Sunday. Given Sunday. Any given yeah. Sunday. He did. Yeah, but that oh, was okay. that was different. It's shot weird too, but it's it's Oliver toned Stone, down. Oliver Stone's done a lot. Down, then. It's more toned down. They use the weird shots in a way where it makes sense. I'm going to give it three to like give Just my opinion because they have my... Oliver know. Stone wrote Scarface. Well, we know Scarface is one and of the And there's actually movies. a scene in the hotel when they're, they're, like, they're flipping through the channels and Scarface comes on. Oh, that's so funny. What a good <laughs> plug-in. Scarface is in every fucking movie. He did... Yeah. Dude, JFK. You ever seen JFK? That's a good movie. Yeah? Like... 10,000 people are in I that fucking movie. I you guys don't like I Am like Mother? No. No. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yo. So, can we talk about that now? Are we done? Oh so, how God. many nobodies we giving this? I'm giving it I'm giving it three and a half. I'm giving it two. Because I, I understand why it's, it's, that it's shot weird. And it's 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 not... it's not. I don't think it's Yo. Oliver Stone's best work. This is madness. It's so many birds. <laughs> who's feeding them? Is somebody oh, feeding them? I don't know oh, who's man. feeding the birds. Platoon... These are all Wall Street. All my friends and ex friends. I mean, these are all my ex friends that I don't fuck with. All over birds. Here. All oh, these birds. You're, you're calling them here. <laughs> you're literally you? calling them. No, they're just where, going where, everywhere. <laughs> where would you rank Oliver Stone as far as directors? He's got to be top ten, right? Now that I'm looking at his movies, top ten, yeah. Like Platoon, Wall Street. Wall Street is dope. Born on the Fourth of July. That's that's all in like a span of like three years. JFK, Natural Born Killers, that. Nixon. Nixon was oh, great. Oh, Nixon, I, I saw Any that. Given Sunday. I saw that. Alexander, World Trade Center, W, Wall Street, Never, uh, the second Wall Street, Savages, Snowden. The second Wall Street is so good. Yeah. Yeah. Snowden is, is Snowden's good pretty good. It's, it was low key. And then he wrote a bunch more that he didn't. He, he wrote Conan the Barbarian, wrote Scarface, he wrote Year of the Dragon, Eight Million Ways to Die. Um, and then so there's a bunch more like that he produces in a different world. These birds is irking me. I just don't want them to shit on me. That's no, the only fine. thing. No, you, why you didn't like I Am Mother? Oh my God. So okay. All right, let's get no, let's get to that. You know I, I it's not that I, no I didn't like it. I, I was trying to be nice, but nah, I <laughs> really didn't like why? it. I love Hillary Swank. That's first off, but to think that. This was going to be different. I just thought it was, was another so bootleg I Am Robot movie. Like, no, it's not. I'm, I'm just saying with the whole I Am Mother, I Am Robot, and it's a that, robotic that movie. Wasn't, that wasn't you my problem. I did watch it. I did. What was it about? 
So this <laughs> this robot creates fertile life to save the world, basically, after some ap- apocalypse or something After the robots around. kill everybody. Yeah, but we find out that, that they're the ones that did it in the end. I was just saying in the beginning, she made it seem like it was an apocalypse in the beginning. It was. Yeah, apocalypse of robots. A robot apocalypse. The robots took over the world. Yes, yeah. that I'm um, no. But so when now she was telling her daughter, yeah. they the can daughter make was curious. Yes, yeah, so they can make humans again. She takes the and creates this birth. Well, she takes a fertile do- uh, an girl. Uh, yeah, and then places in this thing, creates a daughter. Um, and in matters of like, I don't know if it's like milliseconds, the baby starts to grow. It's and, a time lapse. Yeah. Like, so, come on, stop. What? Not milliseconds. No, the but it went literally between an in, instant from the little little dot of no, a fertile. No, it just it just and kept, grew into a baby. They just put it as time, but okay. it went regular time. Yeah. So a daughter is born. the The robot is now the mother of the daughter. She raises this daughter to be smart, intelligent, aware of things, um, all from learning experiences. And the girl, though, of course, is human, so she has emotions and feelings that a robot could never feel. She starts to question certain things of how she got there and what is life out there. And the mother just kept her shield somewhat until she encounters a... You, are you getting this? Is this the same thing you watch? Huh? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah, she encounters oh, this woman who allegedly gets shot um, because she was shot by one of... Did she... I forgot. Did she say who, sh- who shot her? She said it was She did the robots. droid. She, she said it was robots, the droid, right? Man. She yeah, said she, she did get shot. Robots. She did. Because when she pulled it to the side and saw the bullet, bullet but then, But then when they took the bullet out, they were like, this, these bullet, the robots don't use these bullets. Right. Which is bullshit, because they do. Well, then, the robot, after uh, try, the daughter tries to hide the, hum, the, the lady that she encounters, yeah. but eventually the mother robot finds out and tries to help the lady at first. And you guys want to take part in this? I'm, I just want to hear you explain the more. <laughs> I, oh, I mean, well, we find out that the the lady who got shot is actually the girl's mother, the actual mother. They're clones. You missed the movie. That's the mother, though. They're all the same they're person. All the same person. The, 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 the all the she's, all she's the, the same DNA. Yeah. No, so when they created the boy, who was that then? That's it's not the guy that, that was in the book that she was drawing. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, so I just found out how that came to surface. They're all clones. Yeah, yeah. I thought that the, you know what? I swear, I thought the the um the new life because I I saw that it's two resemblance of the the mother and the daughter There's that no look mother. alike. I'm saying the the robot the, is the mother. Right? I know the robot is the mother. No, yeah, I, I see what you're saying. You saw a resemblance between Hillary Swank, Hillary and, Swank the, the and the daughter. Thing that happened over and over. So she yeah. they she made it and then they escaped and then yeah, that's yeah. basically what it is. I, I still thought that I I did not like it. I just I, I, didn't like I it. it was a little weird <laughs> to me. Like I, it, I I'm gonna give it three. I I um You hate sci fi movies. No, no, that's not true. No, I, I sci-fi. love sci fi like movies. movies. I, I just, just Yeah, I didn't I didn't, I, didn't, I was like, all right, this is it was all right. It's like we were like, What's it? What yeah. I didn't hate it. I was just like yeah. That's what I'm saying. I didn't hate it. I just I, I and I, I got I a little weird. I got a little. Um, I mean, I like off. Swing's face. I don't know. I, I got a little thrown off. I'll be honest, because when it came to them going out of the the the, the facility into the farmland of crops and stuff, uh-huh. I I I didn't know like what was gonna happen between uh, the robots finding them or who like someone else them encountering someone else. Another I thought they person? were yeah another there was person. No other people. It was just Hillary Swank. They're all clones. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> the robots have taken. But over. she got out. That's what I'm saying. So she got yeah, out of that. That kind of, that kind of, like, what, like, what was the, what, what was the point of having all those embryos then? No, so they were gonna restart. Restart life. life. Restart life. Recreate Only life. Only to kill them again? I don't know. That's I mean, the, that's, that's, that's another well, thing. To be their slaves, basically. Oh, uh, okay, okay, that makes sense. Okay. Essentially. But to she didn't make that do, that young robot. girl her slave, though. Nobody knows they're a slave, so they're a slave. That's a good point. <laughs> <laughs> and, and maybe that makes sense now because maybe that's why she was asking her like those like questions about ethics. Like, let's say yeah, and then and, and they're looking for a person to pass all these tests. Right. So she has to go through a series yeah. of tests. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot become, the, the like, test part. You know parts. what I'm saying? Right. Because she was like when she when she asked her, um, like if you're a doctor, 
and you have to give up your body part to save oh yeah x amount of people what yeah. would you do and she's like were they good people or like that's what that's what that's all it was yeah yeah and that means she could have failed because you're not supposed to have any type of emotion well i yeah but I, I got the sense that robots she, don't have type in any emotion. Because she, the, that's, the that's daughter, a, you're speaking for robots now. Don't speak for robots. <laughs> I'm speaking for robots. Well, the, robots don't have hearts. Well, we don't know that because you they, don't know that. Because no, because the daughter, the robots daughter, are not here to defend themselves. The daughter, the robots did ask, don't have hearts. People put we, this negative stigma on robots, right? <laughs> we I was, create I was the robots. Them. I understand that. But I was listening to an interview with somebody about robots. Was that Joe Rogan? It sounds like a Joe it Rogan. Was, yes, yeah. facts. <laughs> but he was talking about how. They're making robots, but wouldn't you build a robot the same way you would, like, have a baby? Yeah. So it's like, you don't know. The robot can figure it out and probably be a good person. We're just putting this negative stigma on the robot automatically. Why do we think robots are going to kill us? Because people kill people. No, it's just a thing. It's just a thing. We're looking at things like they're dead. Or there could be a malfunction objects. where you want the person to be a good robot and turns into a bad robot. But why is it bad? This isn't Terminator. Because there could be a malfunction in the robot. One slick of a, t- a one switch or twist of something yeah, but wrong that, wire. But that doesn't make the robot the wrong. That makes we the malfunction. We saw Chucky. Haven't you learned anything? <laughs> that was a human who made Chucky in that movie. He made Chucky evil. The way I see it, the only t- like it, we it, we've seen tons of movies where robots kill people. Yeah, and it's always and it's now it's in your brain. Right. Like yeah. robots are bad. And but really, what, are, are they? Are, but it's like you you, you got to think about it this way. Are they bad or are they just doing what the program to do? But they that's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. That's not a malfunction, though. That's, that's not a malfunction. That's just how the program. robot. Why? Why? Like, do they think, think about Terminator. Let's let's let's, they let's think, think Terminator. People think robots gonna kill us because they are fucking gonna be better than us, and we think we hate us, so we, they're they're gonna they have right. to kill us. Yeah. Look at Terminator, right? The first Terminator. Yeah. Why? Why? Why was, is Arnold good? No, no, the first Terminator. Why did why? Arnold turn good? Yeah. Because he's programmed that way. Yeah. So from the first to the second Terminator, the difference between the first and second Terminator is that Arnold do, Arnold was programmed to be bad first and then good. Who programmed him? Skynet. Yeah. Who made Skynet? Some dude. Some guy made Skynet and he was like, oh, hey, I'm just... All of that necessary. They know you're coming. Right. Imagine that. <laughs> there was a parade here earlier. I know, uh, Dominican, Dominican parade. Everybody was decked out in their flags, yo. I <laughs> hate 42nd Street. We're, I you're hate... Racist. Walking on 42nd Street. <laughs> How am I racist? But you didn't even let you me people finish. People can't have flags. You didn't even let me finish. People can't have flags. No, that's not what I'm saying. I hate 42nd Street because there were so many tourists stopping and taking every day, pictures though. every day. But this is why I hate walking on it. I forget why. Why'd you why. walk that way? I know. I j- that's a, honestly. That's a I question for- we did have. For we you. Did have. I yeah. forget. So when you said you were walking, walking that way. What, what, what train did you take? I take uh, the C. C now. From, from I was uptown? in Harlem. I was in Harlem. Why I took didn't the you D. Why would you and take the D? Why right would I, I? Just let me straight here and I just walk up. Yeah, I but just, then you avoid the walk. You just put you out right no, there. No, I, I, I should have just walked on that block instead of this block because this is the tourist I, bar, block. I, I took, I got, I got to Penn Station. I drove I could have taken. I just remember <laughs> how much I hate 42nd Street. No, it's the worst. I hate 34th Street and 42nd anyway. Street. So how many nobodies you give? I'm giving it three because it, I didn't hate it. <laughs> I give it three. All right. I well, give it I three. Give, no, I, I accept the yeah. three. I mean, three is good. It's a Netflix film, too. That don't mean shit. I, you know I what mean, I did hate? What? 47 meters down. You hated, you hated that? It? Could not stand it. <laughs> uh, All it was I'm gonna tell you was an hour and a half of white privilege <laughs> getting amazing. what they deserve. I did, like the I did like the end. It's amazing. The end is, is my best part. And I'm looking because forward I to seeing the sequel. The the sequel, way. right? Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing it. I think they're going to pick up right where they left I hope they do. I thought that was the beginning. That's what saved the movie for me. Like, and that, I was like, this is stupid. <laughs> That's how I felt when you I know? first watched it. But then thinking back on it, I'm like, this is actually a good I'll movie. I'll tell you, when we, talk, when we get to the part that upset me the most, I'll, I'll, I'll tell Just you. Say but, it. No, the part where they, where, they, where they get the crank going and they're counting the meters when they're going up. Yeah. Oh, I'm like, oh, well, you're an idiot. Yeah, yeah. They're like, 39? 30? I'm like, really? The whole time you're going to do it? Like, the, the, the beginning of the film alone, I wanted to come through the can- I wanted to come through the screen. Because I feel like I was watching Fear Bay. This is some dumb no, ass. No. This is some dumb Fear ass. Bay got me tight. No, no, the no. First, the Fear first, Bay like, 10 is minutes, actually five the nobodies. First, <laughs> the first Bay 10 minutes. is like a half a nobody. The first, Not even. Listen. It's nobody, nobody. This nobody. movie. This movie. The first 10 minutes of 47 meters down is all of... Fear Bay. 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, it is. It's just white it women. Is. It don't is. Know but, it, but it has a good, because it it, it's like, you deserve it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, like, yeah. that's what makes it good for yeah. me. Because, like, I hate these people. And it's like, <laughs> oh, shit, they deserve this. It's, it's like, so wait, how'd they get out? Like, let's get this. What are, their, what are their movies? What are their names? Because I kept I hearing know. their names. Bro, I'm like, who's I don't who? think about names in oh, movies. You know this. Fuck, I forgot. Because, like, I was watching Rush Hour today and fucking. Chris Tucker was calling uh, Jackie Chan, Jackie Chan in the whole, in the No scene. way. In Wait. the end scenes. You know, the little oh, bloopers. Oh, yeah, 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 oh. yeah, yeah, the blooper part. And Jackie Chan was like, yeah, Jackie, all right, Chris Tucker, let's do this. <laughs> oh, my God. So, so I was like, yeah, like, names in movies is hard, bro. So oh, so oh, Ma- Mandy Mandy Moore was Yeah, Mandy Moore is terrible. in it. She's, she, she, Mandy Moore's not a good actress, right? Like, when, Mandy Moore? How'd she get famous? She was a singer, right? Yeah, she's she, a So, baby, come Britney to Spare, me. Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Show me who you are. I have no idea what that song is. I've more. never heard that song. Yes, you do. That's, that's her song? Candy, heard candy. Song. Never heard it. I'm ready for you. I'm something you that's her, like That's her candy. number one hit? Yeah. Oh, she is. No wonder. Like out of here. What? Mandy Moore don't have to do shit. Mandy Moore I've is... I've never heard that song. Is, uh, You're bugging. That song no. is in... Go with, go with Macy's right now. So, that baby, song. come to me. Baby, baby, show go me who and you fucking, are. What is it? Yeah, Justice? Yeah, yeah. What's Swipe that? That, that, like that teen uh, clothing store? Heart, <laughs> Justice? Baby, I'm craving for you. Go in Bed Bath & Beyond. Like I, I do not want to. That shit is in every store. This was this like shit. Teeny Bopper, Britney Spears, yeah. NSYNC, Listen, man, when, uh, when, Blink-182 when, when era. When those people were popular, Mandy I was, was listening. on Entourage. That's What's so it? crazy because you yeah, listen to a lot it. of white people shit. Yeah, I was listening to like Stained and, and Limp Biscuit. I was... Oh, oh Limp Biscuit. I was listening to that garbage. Nah, wow. Limp Biscuit was popping. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I wasn't listening to Mandy Moore. Nah, you don't. Uh, you had to, you had to endure Mandy, Mandy Moore. You had to. Is that the only song she had? Mandy Moore, Jessica Simpson, like all these people. I can't were, like, name one same. Jessica Simpson song. I cannot. Me neither. Jessica Simpson. What do you mean? I know you can't she, name if I hear Jessica it, I'd be like, oh, that's song. Jessica Simpson. But yeah. I can't. I don't know. I uh, I, I would know the these only songs thing because I, know about I had Jessica an Simpson era in this music. You look like you listen to this. I do. This was the shit. The music back then was popular. This is her. This is her. She's like Word Up magazine. Like jeans super low. Huh? Did you wear your jeans super low and have like a? Yeah. No, like, I had name belts. Yeah. Oh, I of course you did. I had name belts. No, no, no. I that's, had, that's more blackish. I had the like, bandanas with the bejewels on them. No, no. You had, I had white, crop you tops. Like, you seemed like you was Britney Spears, Mandy Moore, Christina Aguilera. I like, did. Yo, that Aguilera, was. Yo, first of all, don't shit. shit on that era of music. That I'm was popping ass pop that. music. Not, but no, I feel like I that did, is you. I did. I did. That's why you're corny today. I have that kind of. I have that kind of music, and I also have my black music. Too. So I had my white music. Yeah, but your music, black music was like music. B2K and Okay. But that's that's Terrible. that's why you're corny. How am I corny? B2K <laughs> was the shit. Are you kidding me? No, it me? was. I love B2K. I'm not gonna Yo, lie. No, B2K was the but shit. That's your like I was listening to Dr. Dre and you was listening to B2K. So no, like, that's not true. I was listening to Jay Z too at the same time. No, not that's, not by not oh, that, that's when Blueprint came out. That wasn't that was in that, the CD player. That type of era where Mandy Moore, Britney Spears, and all stuff was when what Blueprint year, what, what came out. It? It was like nine seven. No, nine, that's when six. Blueprint came out. Because I definitely wasn't in the same guy. I will say I was in. I was, oh, Blueprint is 2001, like 2001, 2000. Yeah, because it came out around the same time as Chronic. Yeah, yeah. I was definitely, I was definitely an instant guy, though. I will say, because like people, like the Backstreet Boys were like, they had like Backstreet Boys had like three songs Backstreet that I really Boys enjoyed. Trash. No, that's not true. They had like three songs that were pretty good. That Yo, the one with I the monsters. The, I went to a, a bar yesterday, yeah. and they were playing that shit. I was like, this shit is retarded. This is totally off topic. Yeah, but it goes into Mandy Moore. Oh, yeah, so. Mandy Moore, uh, terrible actress. <laughs> Wasn't she in a movie where she died? Lisa and Katie yeah. are their names. Yeah, this movie. Oh. Right? Yeah, <laughs> wasn't she? Wasn't there a movie where Mandy Moore had cancer and died? No, there was. No. Uh, no. There was a movie where that's, she, she that's, was in some um, serial killer movie too. That yeah. was um. What, a walk to remember. A cancer? That, no. No. Walk to remember. Yes. Hold on. I think yeah. she was in Walk to Remember. I she had cancer. She, was. she died. Isn't that Fault in Our Stars? No, no that's that's a, that's. You're thinking of Cameron Woodley. Diaz. But that's the same movie. What? Cameron Diaz. Yeah, she was in a walk to remember. Yeah, Where did she you was. Cameron Diaz from? Cameron no, Diaz when you said is cancer, an actual great actress. No, when you said cancer, I was thinking of my sister's keeper. Never seen it. My oh my god, that movie keeper. is so. This, they made the, they, the, that movie. They remade like eight times. Yeah. They just remade Fault it with in a our dude. Stars, Fault in Our Stars is with the girl from uh, Big Little Lies, yeah. Shailene, Shailene Woodley. 
the toilet. Mocking Jay, right? Anyway, can no, I just no, give I my little plug in about how I felt about the beginning alone from the shit? I wanted to slap Were these you bitches. You feel, I f- but no. that's how you act. No, though. that's not how I act. <laughs> that is not how I fucking act. That is definitely not how I act. Yes. These two um, bitches acted like all right, so yeah. they were oblivious to shit from the beginning. Like Mandy Moore, Lisa was telling her sister Katie the entire time. Hey, sisters? Yeah. yeah. I don't feel right about this. This bitch Katie was a hoe. She was like hung up on some Katie dude, Katie is right? a hoe. Katie's a hoe. And that Katie dude got around. Left them. Lisa's husband. Yeah, and that's the part that fucked they, me they, up. They were when they right? both left, I was like, these They were in Mexico, yo. right? Walked up. Yeah, so they yeah. meet these two guys that who they sit and have dinner with and everything, and then they find out that these guys like to go out in the water and deep, deep, deep sea dive and look at sharks and shit. No. In a cage. Well, what is it then? They just wanted to do the shark diving thing. Yeah, but they do. They go at a certain point in the water and do and. Yeah, but it would. They did it with a rinky dink fucking guy. Yeah, they did it with. They this. didn't do it with like professional. First of all, was that old man, older man Spanish or was he white? Because he was he's, in Mexico, right? Yeah, yeah but, he was white. but was he? Yeah, but he was white. Yeah. He was white. All right, because. I thought he was Spanish to like white. you know you could be an older looking you look white but you probably are Spanish no, kind of thing, but I don't remember that part. I, you know who that guy is? I actually found him kind of older, it's, attractive he in, uh, a little bit. <laughs> well, he was on he was on stream, season season one of Stranger Things, bro. Right? Yeah, he's the he's the one that creates Eleven. Okay, the, the doctor guy. Okay. He was also in uh, Full Metal Jacket. Anyway, they they go the uh, so Katie the uh, whole ass sister oh, Katie man. tells her. Bitch, let's go. Let's have some fun. Your man just left you. <laughs> Typical fun? shit. Huh? Would you ever do that? Your man what? just left you, bitch. Go deep sea diving or like cage, what a cage shark. Yeah. Whatever. You would do that? Hell yeah. I would never do that. What? Why? Nah, yeah. I would. I wouldn't bitch? do that. Huh? You a little bitch? Yeah. Well, clearly, looking at 100%. this movie, why wouldn't we be? Yeah. First off, it's scary. Yeah. That's why I wouldn't do it. I do it. I wouldn't. You wouldn't do it. I wouldn't. Nah, do it. I wouldn't. I don't want to do it in a cage. I'll do it just freehand. Nah. I want to be able to run. Fuck that. Fuck that. You think you're gonna out swim a shark? Why I'm not would gonna you? swim like you don't like Do you know how big sharks can here's be? The, thing, though. the sharks don't want to right. eat that's people. The that, that's true. Like it, sharks this don't, is the sharks thing typically that don't, don't eat people. Like the cage is honestly if unnecessary. You, if you ever noise at, noise triggers them, definitely. No it doesn't. Yes it does. Make they, noise in water. When they make you make noise in water. No, I'm saying like <laughs> when they banged on the cage that that triggered them to, to hear the sound to That's come and it's attack a them. Movie. Yo, you got lightheaded. Chill. <laughs> Why? Why? You said make noise underwater. Oh no, he's so fucking stupid because that's not what I was talking about. <laughs> but that's exactly what you said. I'm like, saying, noise triggers I thought sharks. We were talking about sharks the, have ears now. No, like, I thought we were, we were referring to the movie when they made the noise of banging this on the cage. This is a movie. This yeah. is a movie. Other Here's than that, thing. yeah, no, you can't make noise Here's underwater. Sharks don't eat people. They don't. Typically, when some when somebody gets attacked by a shark, the thing the that shark the will chum, bite, when the chum fell in the cage, like the chum fell yeah. in, then you oh, have yeah, a problem. Oh yeah, absolutely. Like that's when you have the problem. Yeah. Absolutely. But other than that, it's like whatever, man. So anyway, they they they, uh, they go into the <laughs> they go into the middle of the ocean after speaking to these guys. Katie, her whole ass sister, tells her, "Let's have fun." Let's bitch. Your man just left you. Let's go do this. Like you don't live. Your your su- basically. Just Katie be, was telling her bang. sister, "You're a boring bitch, and let's go have some fun." And Katie was just trying to be a helpful sister, and you know, Wait, give we her. We go back to the beginning. No, I'm just anything? saying like how they're yeah. No, they get into so the good. they get into the middle of the ocean after meeting the guys. The uh, the guys and and tell tell them they went first. The two guys go down in the ocean. Mm-hmm. How but, far um, were they supposed to go? They were right there. They were they were at the height, and then the, the, when they fucking knocked the shit over, it yeah. fell. Right. So they were at a, appropriate depth. Yeah. So the because there's a guy walking by with like a shark fin on his head. Oh yeah, that's so funny. <laughs> that's so funny. So there. So the, oh, the so the fisherman, of course, triggers it by giving fish heads out to the water with blood. Of course, the sharks start pulling up. Why is it called chum? Chum, chum? bucket. Yeah. Because it's a mixture of, of filth fi- fish parts. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. It's not like a fish. It's like chopped up fish parts. Yeah. yeah. And so, of course, the sharks start triggering. You got the sharks are about 20 feet. Um, and the, the guys 
first when they went, they had no problems. They come back up. The girls go inside now. They get suited up and go into the water. And why didn't they do? Why didn't they do guy girl guy girl? Like why would the girls gotta go and why the guys gotta go? This is a movie. It is because <laughs> it's a movie. Because shit let's like let, that really doesn't exist. Girls. Yeah, like no, that would have made sense. It's like all right. I've done this before. You haven't. Yeah. I'll do it with you. Yeah. And then they do it. Yeah, that was the fucked up part. That, that was fucked up. Like, they knew and that then, these chicks didn't know. And then, homeboy wouldn't have lost his camera. Yeah. Right. By the way, also stupid. The thing has a loop on it. Put the fucking thing around your wrist. And tie the... Sh- yo, I, that's another thing. I was like, yo. That made me so mad. It made me mad, too. Because we already know the camera's going to drop. But sometimes people don't want to hold it. No, you don't fuck hold that. It. Just put it around the wrist. You just yeah, put it around the wrist. Yeah, but then it's annoying. It's like, hey, I know, I know. But, but this you know chick what, wanted you know, to take pictures annoying? and she knew what she was Losing doing. Losing a camera. Losing a camera. She knew what she was doing. It's definitely more annoying than that. Clearly, I could e- easily sort out this movie because... What year did this movie come out? I don't know. It came like three years ago, I want to say. I could easily sort out this movie. Are those that cameras was gonna specifically be a designed to go underwater? Because I was like, what, GoPro? White. It was a GoPro, right? It was like, no, I think, I think it was like a... Film. Oh, yeah, no, the, 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 it's like, yeah, those are, yeah. It was going to be a corny-ass, okay. white, dumb-ass film. And I already knew it was going to be corny. And you liked it? No, I did. I, I wanted to slap these hoes. That's how much I wanted but to. But that makes it a good movie. No, because when it, we, when you react to a movie that way, it's kind of good. They get stuck down there, by the way, as they're lowering, getting lowered down. The hook, this old ass rinky dink ass hook, decides to break. Duh, <laughs> we know that shit was gonna happen. And it falls on her it leg. It falls forty-seven meters down. The old, the, the older sister, right? Yeah. It fell, yeah. Forty-seven it meters down, leg. and like I felt like every time, like. They, they had they, like, oh, they got a little bit of good news. The guy was like, nah, well, you might die if you go straight. <laughs> like, my so he really got on my nerves. He was too. like, he was, they, they were like, all right, I, th- I think we can we can get to the get, get to the surface. And he's like, well, if you go really fast, you're gonna die. So don't do that. I also need to let people know that real. in this film, yeah, yeah, the bends, in, they call it? in this yeah, film, sure. oxygen sure. is very important in this film because. This is what I they mean, really, really want. Get too much oxygen, you could die. Too much. Oh yeah. So that's loopy. what I'm saying. Why yeah. it's that's why it's important it's because fake oxygen. Have you ever at been one to, part. Have you been to an oxygen bar? A what? A what? An oxygen bar? No. No. What's up? Why do you find these shit? An the oxygen bar. They like you go to a bar. It's like a regular bar, and then they hook you up to oxygen tanks. And like, that sounds what? crazy. That sounds I, I don't so want weird. no. Yo, I wonder if they're like I forgot where. I seen the IV bars. I've seen the IV bars. Yeah. I seen that. You seen what? Yeah. IV bars. So like. I've seen it in Vegas. Yeah. Like if you like for a bachelor party. You can you can have a party at an IV bar, and like you could drink all you want, and when you start getting like fucked up, like they'll they'll put you off to the side. Oh no no! I, I see them put shit in the IV. Oh that's oh no! Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with people? What are we doing in this world? What it's are not we doing? Kill you. I think I think this. I mean, world, you're drinking anyway. It's gonna be in your bloodstream. It doesn't anyway. matter. This is just a fucked up world to stick needles in people and think that this is okay to have a, yeah. a, a IV. Get some bar. water with a little bit of cocktail, with a little bit of um. In, in Brooklyn. Water with a little bit of bourbon in it? Oh my god. In system? What is no, what the <laughs> fuck? No, 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 no. There's go? some shit you would do. do. It's in Brooklyn. What? The oxygen bar? Yeah. Let me see what it looks like with the oxygen. Oh, we're tank? gonna have to go there one day. I'm not, I'm not doing I'm not shit. Doing I'm not doing that. I don't want nobody's oxygen around my face. Me either. There's a few. There's a, Unless I'm in the water with like I'm okay. a specialized person. Uh but while they're it? looking at this, I'll just complete the finish of the story. So oxygen, of course, Where's is the oxygen, main though? main important thing because they have these tanks that's on after a certain it's amount it's of good. oxygen you know you could <laughs> die so at one point they both were on E almost on their oxygen tank and luckily the the well, they sent down the captain sent down like two oxygen tanks yeah, yeah. cause oh she had to get out dodge the sharks yeah to get it yeah Which is just mind you I meant to plug in real quick. When the girls drop down and at a certain amount of time, the ship leaves. And then they thought, we all just thought dip. that they just yeah. was going to not Dipped come on. back because, one, Why nobody else. See, I really thought it was going to take a turn for left because, one, nobody else knew that they were out in an yeah, ocean. Yeah, fuck them bitches. And they, yeah. Yeah, that's that's what I, I thought. I, was like, I thought they was going to be yeah. like, who's yo, gonna know? savage. Just, that was a real savage move because I saying, thought honestly, that was going to happen. Who's going to know? Nobody. But that's what I'm saying. Nobody. I thought they was going to do some fuck shit. And the re- Somebody's going to say Well, besides, of but course, the resort. Like, we left them a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. the resort but, and, and would only have the last no, destination well, where they would be in. they did not. The, the reason why, they, didn't, they went away from the resort right. they didn't go, to it get was, this. It wasn't yeah. This is not was part of the resort, resort yeah. package. That's what I'm saying is that the resort only would have the last time stamp of when they were there. And then all all bets Breakfast. were off, basically. Mm-hmm. So anyway, the so we think that they leave them. They're down there for a while. They're losing oxygen. They encounter some sharks. At one point, 
the sister decides to get up and try to get the, because oh, while the ship had left and fell from the hook, this big, uh, what was it, like a chain. this big chain with the tractor fell on top of the cage, so they couldn't um, kind of get out. At one point, the sister had to take her gear off and oh, yeah, slide the, out uh, of the, the cage the, the winch. Uh-huh, to try to push the thing up. At one point, the sister <laughs> like encounters, movie, <laughs> yeah. encounters the shark. They yeah, make their fun. way to get the track off of the, the cage. Sequel, the end made me want to see the sequel. Yeah. They make their way to get the track off the cage. At one point, you know, the guys come back, the ship comes back. There's one of the one of the guys that they encountered starts looking for them in the ocean. And the shark eats him. And the shark, <laughs> he comes to save her, and he gets killed because the shark eats him. But again, that would never happen because the shark wouldn't. <laughs> have, the shark would have bit him, and then we're like, oh, I don't want this, and let it go. He would have. That was a huge ass shark, yeah. though. Yeah, that's would have, a twenty foot shark. But sharks, 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 don't, again, sharks don't eat people. kill people like that. Sharks. How many? I mean, let me look that up. How many times a year? I want to. It's shark. a lot. Killed, no. killed right. A bit, killed, no. yes. How sharks many, killed. I'm, people, I'm pretty sure the rate is How many people you think killed? by sharks. Pick a number before you look up. How many people I think got killed? Killed a year. A year? Every Maybe like year. 200. Really? I say like three. Killed? In killed. the world? Dead. In the world? Yeah. You would say three? I say like three people. What do you think? She said 200. I said 200 in the whole world. I would say 200. There's a. All right. Me, just the United in States, how many, how many think, do you think? In, in just, just in the United, United States? States? Yeah. Two. Six. On average, there are 16 shark attacks per year. Zero with people. With one there. fatality. Wow. Every, every two years. Wow. Wow. Sharks don't kill people. Sharks wow. don't kill people, bro. Wow. They just check you. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, sharks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're in the wrong, like, you're in the wrong lane over right. here. Sharks are like, way like, out of your league. Sharks are like OG <laughs> gang members. They're like, look. What up? Yeah, you crossed the wrong border. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It's like it's like gangs, real shit. Yeah, yeah. no, gangs, I believe gangs, that. real gangs, gangs like like gangs I'm like Bloods and Crips. Yeah, they don't really kill people. They don't people. really kill people. They kill but each other. Maybe. They check. They check. They'll check you. Yeah, you know, it might be one death. You know, <laughs> yeah, but yeah, and that's on you, honestly. That's what that, that's what I'm. We just figured it out. I just figured it out. Sharks are gangsters. Sharks are gangsters. Sharks, sharks are, are reincarnated sharks, gangsters. Sharks are the are the no, crimps they have of the, never of the been, sea. They've never been lost. They've been here yeah. more longer than we ever have. Yeah, this, this sharks, sharks have been here hundreds so of years. So they've been repping their sets for a minute now. Sharks? I think sh- there's, there's probably sharks that have been around longer than Bloods and Crips. <laughs> no, that's a fact. Yeah. No, sharks are been, dinosaurs, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Like they've the been repping their sets for shark. centuries. You ever seen Meg? No, I haven't seen it, but I've heard of it. It's City Bag, <laughs> what the is movie that? Bag. The Meg, yeah. It's, it's, it's about a Megalodon. It's a shark movie. Oh, no. The Megalodon is the oldest With shark. The only Statham. shark movie I like is Jaws. Jaws is trash. There's no sharks in Jaws. I love Jaws. In Jaws? Is shark Jaws is sharks. There's one shark in Jaws. Yeah. That's the point. Did you watch Jaws? His name is Jaws. Jaws, no, all, no. yes, his name? all Jaws. of Jaws I've watched. Did you watch the movie Jaws? Yes. They don't show the shark. They show it one time. Yeah. Okay. It's one time. And it's a huge one. No. Watch it again. At the end of the film, when he comes Which through one? the thing. Watch the movie. Which again. one is the one with Meg the... is a huge shark. If you watch Meg. At the end of Jaws, when he's getting ready to to chomp through the 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 the, ha- boat? the, the boathouse. It doesn't hold up. <laughs> Yo, I'm just you. saying, watch like that's one of my favorite shark films. Other than that, boat. I don't really have shark films that are besides Shark Tale. And other than that, that shark doesn't Tale count. Is fine. <laughs> Which one is that one? That's with Will Smith, Deep and we Blue talked Blue about that. So you didn't like Deep Blue Sea? Oh, Deep Blue Sea was corny as fuck. I no, hate that movie. Hell, cool it's so yeah, yeah. bad. Wait, Deep Blue Sea was stupid. Is that also the one? Of Samuel course Jackson. I watched yeah. it, but it's stupid. Okay. So well, Samuel Jackson, Samuel died, Jackson right, so. dies in the majority of the movie. But back that in movie day. made sense. Because they were because genetically engineered. They genetically engineered the sharks yes. to kill people. Okay, yeah, that I remember. Yeah, I remember when, yes, Samuel Jackson's giving that big-ass speech and the shark fucking comes Yo, and, and eats him. That's, that, I saw that in the movie theaters, actually. I saw that movie theaters. I, didn't. I, I was with my uncle and my aunt <laughs> and my two theaters. cousins and, and my sister, and we went and saw that. That was lit. In the movie theaters? The, yeah, it was in a black movie theater, yeah, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was lit. <laughs> the best part is, like, hello, Cool J. Like, the shark gets him at the end, and he's like, it's just... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like you know, uh, I was watching LL Cool J yesterday and all. Uh, what was you Deliver us from Eva. Let me tell you something. Oh my LL god, cool LL Cool J can act. Kenny, maybe he's not. <laughs> LL Cool J is not a bad actor. He had one good movie. That's not true. He had one good movie where he was acting in good. Two. I say. I say two good. Movies. Which What's one would you movie? say? I, well, what, what, which one are you talking about? Uh. Cause I'm, I mean the, you, the, the one with Omar Epps. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that was the good one. Omar Epps, yeah, 
Yeah, he's good in that. And he's also good in any given Sunday. Mm. He's good in every, he's pretty good in every, any given Sunday. Nah, he's Deliver us from Eva is funny. Deliver us from Eva is funny. Especially who's, the who's funeral the scene. In, in, uh, uh, Gabriel Union. <laughs> okay, <I just laughs> yeah. no, actually, everybody. Gabriel Union in this movie uh-huh. and, and uh, Megan Goods in that movie. I, I do remember seeing it. I don't remember a lot of it, but I remember seeing it. The shoes and the casket. <laughs> what else is he in? Huh? What else is he in? You ever seen Rollerball? He was in Ro- Rollerball. Rollerball. He was okay in that. Uh, I hated that movie. I don't think I, I wanted to, that to watch that. That movie used to come on all the time. It's a remake. Yeah. The original is much better. I hated Rollerball. Because there was an era of movies where they were remaking, like, all right. Like if they like if they remade like Running Man, right, with yeah. Schwarzenegger, if they if they remade that now, I think it'd be it'd be a little better. But there was a time when they were remaking those movies, and like it wasn't. What what, is, what do you it wasn't good. Any given Sunday, Last Holiday, Deliver Us from Evil, SWAT. Into SWAT. He's pretty good at SWAT. SWAT. Right, I give him SWAT. Oh, I like SWAT. I, SWAT. I saw SWAT. I give him SWAT. Deep Blue Sea, Kingdom Come. What did you oh, I remember Kingdom Come. Yeah. Kingdom <laughs> oh, Come. Wildcats, Rollerball, Mine Hunters. Okay. Grudge Match, Out of Sync, Hawaiian Five O. That's a show. Edison, yeah, he's Toys, doing, he's been doing TV for like Woo, 10 years now. Woo was good. Caught Up, The that. Right to Remain you Silent, The Deal, I've Touch, World War Two. He was in. He was in fucking Rugrats the wild, Go Wild. The Rugrats. B Four, Neighbors Two, Turntables. Um, okay, Charlie's he's Angels. Two? Oh, he was in Halloween H Two O. I remember he was the security right. guard. So terrible. That yeah, was yeah, that was that was that bad. Was a bad movie. Terrible. Uh, that Charlie's was Angels. That was, bad, that was just a bad movie in and general. That's really about it. Like Common but then he, he also they got to do a movie together. I like love Common. Common's Common a good Common actor. Common can act. Common can act. Method Man can act. as a bad guy. Common can definitely act. Method Man can actually act, no, too. Man can act. Method Man can act. Yo, I saw The Cobbler. He was good. Right? He was good in that. You ever seen For The Cobbler? Real. No. It's Cobbler just, is it's, good. It's, uh, it, was a, it, was, it was right after Adam Sandler got that deal with Netflix. Went straight to Netflix. It was uh, Adam Sandler. Oh, I saw the preview for it, but never watched yeah, it. Yeah, it's good. Okay. Adam Sandler plays uh, he plays the son of a guy that owns a shoe store, and like they could make a sequel to that. They could, yeah. And you, if you put on the shoes of the person you made it, you, like you, you get to be them for. Yeah, you get to be them. You get to oh, be that's kind of cool. No, you just right? get to be them. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh that's cool. Because yeah. he makes it, dude. It's what's magical is the thing. All right, so the, he, you yeah. know how they they fix shoes and shit. Yeah, yeah. he's got an old school. In the shit. basement, it was like an old school one. With special threading, yeah. And if you make a shoe with that threading, whoever shoe it is, you get you to be, be that. Oh, person. that's so cool. So it nah, was like, that's dope. Watch that that's movie. Dope. It's good. That's movie dope. Is, that movie is crazy. That's Method, dope. Method Man, between, I mean, he's and he's got range. Like he was, it's good in How High. Yeah, Method Man is crazy. He's, I mean, Method he's crazy. Man, yeah. He was on The Wire. Yeah, he was. He was very good. On, so, and of course, the greatest movie of all time, Belly. So just to wrap nah, up, he was in um, what's that movie? Uh, Fuck. With, the, with the kid and he and he's like smoking weed with his therapist. Oh, hold on. We got he's like it. A, he's like a nineties kid. Oh, I know what movie we're talking I'm about. Um Smoking weed with his therapist? The sitter? No. No, no, no. He was funny. He was in the sitter. sitter. He's funny in that too. Let's go. He's been in a few, a lot of movies, yeah. actually. Yeah, Method Man's been in a movie. Can movies. I just fit, wrap up the yeah, movie, yeah. though? Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Okay, so while you guys are looking for that, I just want to let you guys know. So after, you know, the guy that was supposed to come and save them gets eaten by the shark, now it's still her and her sister looking to get out. At one point, the sister tries to get the oxygen tanks because the boat does come back to give them oxygen tank, knowing too that they are low on their oxygen. The sister encounters the shark, and it looks like the shark ate the sister's head off, bit the head off. So now it's up to uh, Mandy Moore to complete the job and try to survive. And, you know, she tries to get out of the cage and, and, and you know, rise up. And what happens is, uh, uh, what happens is as she's trying to come up, you know, she, she thinks that she's being saved. Her, we find out her sister actually didn't die, but her, her sister got her lung, uh, yeah, something sorry. punctured yeah, right. where... The sister was dying and bleeding heavily, and she grabs the sister and tries to rise up in the ocean slowly because if you rise up to the top, you can die. You get the bends. And so as she's rising up, they, they make it to the surface. They get, oh, as she's making it to the surface, the shark comes and bites her. Almost. No, bites her, uh-huh. Mandy Moore, and the sister already was already punctured from the shark previously okay. before. Okay. And they, they wind up getting both of them in the, in the boat. And she's 
in a day she's happy and stuff then we find out at the end that she's hallucinating she never even made it to the surface yeah. all of that oxygen can get to you and make you hallucinate it and see things and she's she, she she's still under fucking she water. still yeah. was underwater but she was dreaming that she was already being saved meanwhile the captain is trying to get in contact with the teller that the coast guards come in and that's how the movie ends and you the coast guards actually do the... come and get her eventually well, we don't know. well you don't know that's true. You have to watch part two. That's yeah. true. That's true. That's true. Well, in the in the film, it looks like she's being saved. She's going to be saved. But the sister is dead. Yeah, sister's dead. Sister yeah. died. The sister never lived. We like it was just. What could part two be about? That's what I want to know. We're, like it's well, called uncaged. uncaged. So maybe they're going so down maybe there. Maybe they got with her no out cage. and then something happened, and now she's stuck in the water without the cage. I don't know. Yeah. Are we gonna have it's to watch a new this, set right? Of girls or something, There's yeah. a movie that I want to see too with those young kids. I want to. Yeah, laugh. yeah. We're talking, yeah. So we're doing it. Uncaged and we're doing Good Boys. Yeah, yeah. I want to see that. That looks so funny. We're doing Good Boys and Uncaged. Did you ever see Sausage Party? Yeah. Did you see it sober? I I don't like Sausage Party. But I saw a corny ass film tonight. I mean the today. The is the bad guy. Like what is this like? I was watching a corny you film like today, you guys. Party? What movie? It was called. Um, uh, Shit! It was just called something. Yo, watch some, the Wagner's. Son of Son of Something. Wagner's. And it was on Netflix, and I was like, Christine, son, me and Christina was the watching. Son, the son of a, I, I, I saw it. But it's I like this it. whack ass horror film that didn't make sense. Son of what? Uh. I've recently watched. No, it's an it, and I think it was a Netflix film too, which is so funny. But yeah, but we're doing. Uh, I'll find it next cool. time. Forty-seven meters down too. And uh, 27 gotta, meters down too. I just got a friend question. Something I, super I'm, weird. I'm, I'm dying to know what happens after this. And then the good boys. Yeah. Good boys looks like it's gonna definitely yeah, make me I laugh. You guys didn't want to watch stories in the dark or some shit, right? Yeah, no, I'm sorry. Endora. You don't watch it. Oh my god. <laughs> so I mean, like, if you want to, it was like York, people. People the horror movie. New York. People, who, people are not from New York and they listen to this. Yo, like, that's I was trying to. I was just trying not to laugh this at his own tone because that was the York. most yep. creepiest shit ever. Oh, I gotta tell. What? What? So, Friday I went to the Mets game, right? Uh huh. Uh, one of the best games I've ever been to in my life. Uh, by the way, I don't know if you guys saw the picture. Uh, yes, I saw it. Yeah. You were take your shirt off. I took my shirt off. Yeah, khakis. <laughs> Why did you wear khakis to a I baseball? I came from work. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what's wrong with wearing khakis to a baseball game? It's just odd. Ah, it's just, it's just I, I, can, I, can I feel like that's... Yeah, com- but that makes sense. Um, just speaking from... Isn't that a comfortable wear for your package? Like, you have... My dick? Khakis? Yeah, like your... My like, dick is comfortable wearing whatever. Wearing sweats. Isn't, isn't your dick like comfortable? And My dick is comfortable wearing like, like, everything. In khakis. I wear. Actually, I'm about to go to H and M and buy more. I understand tight jeans is a no no, but if you're wearing khakis, your balls should be. I'm about be to go to H and H and M and get more pants. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'm I so I leave work right. I, I, I'm, I'm on, my, on my way to the Mets game, and I'm on the seven train, and we get to we get to Woodside. I think it was Woodside. No, it was before Woodside. It doesn't matter. Um, Pack train, fucking <laughs> people are squeezing in, and this this guy gets on. Uh huh. The Spanish dude gets on, and like right behind him is this like, I guess maybe Puerto Rican lady. I don't know. She's Spanish. And immediately, just fucking, this lady pushes him. She's like, don't grab my titty. What? Yeah. And the guy's like, what are you talking about? And she's like, don't grab my titty, you fucking pervert. And she starts smacking him in the back of the head. Oh, mad shit. Mad hard. So now she's, in, like, in the doorway, and the door won't close because she's standing there. And, like, like, she's just punching this guy and punching this guy. And I'm like, yo, I'm trying to get to this fucking game. Could somebody, like, get in between them and... <laughs> calm this down and nobody's just people are just watching and I don't know if I've, it's because I'm getting older and I like I hate people delaying me so if I gotta step in I'm gonna step in right there's a movie going on well, go ahead go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. There's so a what? so uh, so I'm like I said fuck it I get in between them you yeah I'm like lady you gotta chill she's like he grabbed my titty and I'm like, okay, Why I get... Why are you getting in between? Because I'm trying to get this train moving and get to the Mets game. So they stopped the train? Yeah. Why? Because she was in the doorway. Oh. So I'm like, lady, either get on, get off. Like, we, 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 can't, we can't do this. <laughs> I need to be somewhere. And she stuffed you. Get, let's check it out. So she's like still, she's like spit, she spit on the guy over my shoulder. 
Jesus. She fucking, she's wailing on this guy. Like, breaks his AirPod. Oh, my like God. Like, it falls out of his ear and he stomps on it. Like, oh, like watch it. Now, it's a crazy point, end to this episode. But go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> now, at this point, she moves in closer, so the door's finally closed. I'm like, all right. Like, they're separate. She's still trying to yell at him, call him a pervert. And I'm like, she's like yelling at me now because she's like, you're defending him. And I'm like, I'm not defending nobody. I'm just trying to go watch the fucking Mets. I don't give a fuck right. about your problem or his problem. I just don't want to be delayed anymore. And she's like, she's like, you need to mind your fucking business. I'm like, you do. sure, whatever. Can you I do. get to this game? So uh, she's like, she's, she's still talking. She's like, he better get, he better not get off of my stop. I'm going to spray him in the face. I'm just All like, of that? Where is he at? He's like behind me. Kind of. You're the like, barrier between them yeah. right now? Like, you should have just walked away after the train closed. That's it. You're done. Your job is well, done. It was, was packed train at that point. So it was like, it was, there wasn't really like, a, a, a lot oh, of yeah, space Oh, yeah. Think about it. Every football, football, baseball game right, is always so, packed on a train. So now uh, she <laughs> she's still talking and speaking in Spanish and like talking shit about this guy and blah, blah, blah. So then um, he gets off at like Woodside. It was express train. So the next train is Junction Boulevard. So then, uh, did he, he really touch a titty? I don't think so, because <laughs> the way he got on, he, he might have brushed up against her by accident. by accident. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm, I was trying to tell her. I was like, it was probably by accident. Clearly, he's he doesn't like he said something to you. She wanted attention. She just wanted yeah. So I was like, and then first of all, she's still yelling, and I'm like, lady, shut the fuck up. No, don't say anything. Is that? <laughs> I got so mad. Okay, it was go. Like, right. like so she's like swinging and it hits me in the mouth. She and hit then, you. Yeah. So at this point, I'm like livid. And I'm just like, and as soon as she hit me, she calmed down. She's like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. I didn't. I was like, so you, you, that's how I know she was just fucking around. She's like, because she, she calmed down immediately as soon as she hit me in the mouth. So then I'm like, all right, whatever. It's fine. The guy gets off. I sit down. And everything's chill. She's still talking. And everybody's like, what the fuck is wrong with this lady? She gets off at Junction Boulevard. And as she gets off, she's like, and you need to mind your fucking business. <laughs> so I was like, oh, this fucking lady. <laughs> so I get up. And I get off the train. And you delay the train. No, I, I, I got off. <laughs> there was enough people getting on and off. I, I knew I had a few seconds. Uh -huh. So I was like, you need to shut the fuck up. Get the fuck off the train. I'm tired of your bullshit. Go home and shut the fuck up. Oh my so I God. get back on the train. What's and everybody's, the everybody's, everybody's like, like <laughs> that, you're the crazy one. <laughs> <laughs> that's me on the trail. I'm like, nah, this guy's the crazy one now. So then it's, fuck is so then it's like super quiet for like the next couple stops. And I'm just like, sorry, guys. <laughs> you said that? Yeah. <laughs> they were like, this one girl was like, nah, she was dragging it. I was like, yeah, right? I feel um, like people are so extra sometimes it's for no reason. <laughs> that was it's thin. Stan can sometimes be extra. No, if I, if I you drink. You don't even know. Sometimes you can be extra. When? Me? You can be extra. When have I been extra? The After the game, down. you walked out. You the ladies off the train, <laughs> and you walk off the train to yell at her. Yeah, that's extra, bro. So yeah, because you don't know what would have happened if you would have. What if that the door's either? closed? You seen the shit that you seen the shit, seen the shit online where the dude was talking shit and then he spit before yeah, the door closed. Yeah, yeah. Fuck I don't see. I don't see a problem with that. <laughs> I didn't shit, see nothing wrong with that. You spit in my face. That's disrespectful. I would never spit on somebody. I would never. No, I didn't see nothing wrong with that. Being extra, thinking you could get away with it. Them, that was God too with opening them doors. Son, he home, whooped home that. The door's gonna open already. If you home get a bullet, yeah. the door they're yeah, gonna yeah, press it. Because yeah. they're gonna press it to fix because they gotta fix it. Yeah. That, that shit was hilarious. That was, he was like, I missed the train for this. I think that I think the whoever the conductor was did that because maybe they saw it. No, no, they had once there's a, a lodge in the door, yeah. they gotta to they gotta reclose it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, that was God. They, they open they open one set, yeah. they close one set. You ever seen it? A train move with the doors open? No. no. Seen that? Yeah, I've been on that. Oh shit! Door wide open. Shh. Nah, oh shit! Oh my god! Like yeah, no. Crazy. No one, no one stopped the train and yelled to the train. No, it closed the next stop, but I seen it. Like, it was wide open. Oh my both, god! Both, I would be so scared. Yeah. <laughs> just one door, like or, nah, both doors. No. no I'm playing, like, like, uh -uh. Uh, oh no, no, just just like one. One door, set of doors. Like, but yeah, you could see door. everything yeah, and yeah. hear everything yeah. and feel everything. And it was in the Bronx. It was like on the, the top shit. Oh, oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, no. Yo, I would have reported. It wasn't like in the tube. Why didn't you report that? Was anybody sitting in? No, we all saw it. We were like, oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I'd be fucking scared too. That's the most what are you going to do? That's we the, can't most the next stop it closed. The next stop it closed. That's the most Bronx thing I've ever heard in my life. Yeah, that's some crazy shit. I've seen that shit. 
That shit is crazy. I've seen dudes ride the train. I've seen that. You seen you? that? Like outside the like door? Outside like outside doors, yeah. Like this? There's a... There's a video of it. There's a video of a guy doing it. No, I've seen it. Wait like a minute. in Excuse life. In Wait real a life. minute. Hold on. I've seen this shit on. in real life. Hold on. You've seen dudes ride the train. I've seen a lot of shit on the train. Like you've seen guys ride the back of the train. Not the, Not back. the back. Ride the door. The door. There's a video in where the Bronx, there's a guy riding the door. Back. What is Wild it? shit happens in the Bronx. It's always the Bronx. Because you know why? The stops are like. That's not true. Mi- wild shit happens right here no, in Wild shit city. happens everywhere in New York. But there's like the stops in the Bronx are like three minutes apart. It's yeah. like really a waste of time. Yeah. You could walk them sometimes. Yeah. And then and like people ride the train yeah. that block sometimes. I saw a guy take a shit in between the do- in between the, the cars on. Oh, on the I, I saw somebody throw up the other day I between the cars. I saw a woman. I saw a crackhead pee I on peed, the train before. I peed on, I peed I've seen a dude piss in between the cars. No, I've, she yeah. actually stood I in a peed, corner I, when and I was peed little. On the yeah. train. I peed on, on, on across. You, so no, what's, what's, actually, your, what's your method? Do you? Oh no, I never. I don't do this regularly. I did it when I was a kid. Oh my so god. So what do you th- what do you, you think is the best issues. method? Do you open the door and pee piss that through way? the door? No, do I you... piss sideways. Like I I no. was in between the cars, yeah. both legs on one car, like Oh, <laughs> no, I don't do that. I did that. What I did, That's what I did. What I did was I went I stood <laughs> yeah. in between. I let the door close. Oh yeah, no, god. the door's closed. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I stood in between. I did it on the L train. No way. Well, you can't do it. It's different for you. You gotta no, crouch and shit. I mean, it's a lot. but it's a lot no, of like, uh, no, like that's just. It's you know how easy that is for guys to piss. You ever threw up on the train? No. Why? In between I the cars? Handle, no. Why? No. I, I, I don't throw. I've never, I've never needed to. Facilities that hold bathrooms that do Where? that. Where? All right, hold on, hold on. You don't ever throw up when you're at the party. It's always away from the party yeah. where you're throwing up. Um, technically. You've never thrown out like thrown up on in public? No. Actually, yes, you have, I have. You, got, you haven't Actually, gotten drunk have. before. I have. I have. I remember one time I came from a party. Of course, we pulled the car over to the yeah. side and I threw up on the side street. Yeah, that's what you got to yeah. do. My but, ex pissed in the street. Over, I, I never forget to this day by fucking 42nd over there on the other side. Oh, I've had many times I had to pull over. She's like, pull over, pull over. I I'm like, what the fuck I have many times where I peed in public. In the fucking thing. I was like, y'all, I threw up on the highway. Like, Peeing in public, yes. I, I mean, sometimes you have to pull the doors. I would be with a girl. Sometimes oh, we have a little shit. accident. I, and I was walking up 7th Avenue. I saw that one You get ready to go. You put the double doors in. You put a one girl in front of you and you squat down and you Was I with you when we see some crazy shit? Probably. No, that was with you, right? What? When we saw the girl just, just like in the street pissing. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah, that was god. last weekend. Oh, when you guys left here? Yeah. yeah. We, I took her <laughs> to a car and fucking just a lady just pissing right there. And then somebody stopped with their car with their kids right there, right next Watching to the Watching it like stupid. Oh wait, shit. I was with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. Where was that? No, you wasn't with us. No, no, no. where that Because we went uptown. I don't know. Saw it was. That. I saw it with you. Yeah. Where was that? I think it was with you. Yeah, it was with you. It wasn't no, with you. No, I we saw somebody peeing. No, it was, a, it was it was a, it was it was a tra- a trans girl. Yeah, it was a trans tranny. chick. Like, yeah. Where was that? <laughs> I don't even remember God, where that you was. You guys see a lot of shit too. I think that shit was crazy. That was crazy it was, though. I but that, that, that was recent. I think it was two weeks ago. Without yeah. his dick. Yeah, that was recent. I've seen recently. plenty of times a couple of people, men, have whipped out their dicks. No, but this was a tranny pissing yeah. in the middle of the street, <laughs> like in broad daylight. <laughs> like broad daylight. Oh no, I didn't see pissing that. Pissing right there, and then <laughs> no, somebody had a fucking yeah, Escalade with their kids in yeah, the back yeah, and stopped yeah, right, yeah, right there in front of them, and then got out the car like nothing. Like oh yeah, let's get our bags. That had to be like two weeks ago when we left. When we left Chelsea. Yeah. Yeah, because I went to Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's, yeah. It was on like Which 20... one? Downtown no, Chambers? The one, the one oh, on, by, on like by 21st the, by the and 6th. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Because, uh, yeah, we were walking. To, I was walking well, to Penn Station. Well, y'all in, the, in, y'all in the fucking weird-ass area to see that shit. No, nah, 6th Avenue. Y'all that in that weird-ass nah. area to see shit that like shit that. That shit was crazy. Broad daylight, though? Yeah. It's on a still Sunday? The Lord's Day. On the Lord's Day. Yeah, well. No fucks. We live in the most craziest weirdest no ass place ever here. this conversation got so we done control. all right that was it that, that was a nice little end to the little show <laughs> did the contest oh, people wait. answer you yeah i got oh, this yeah. Stuff. everyone stuff, out. stuff is going out everyone got tomorrow. to you stuff is going out well, Thank everyone you. know by the way i, I also well actually, whatever you whatever we don't use we're gonna just I'm use user, it yeah, I'm, yeah user. I'm sorry uh, like you guys we gave you like almost damn the, near uh, a month to, after the mets game i tried to start a black lives matter trend on the seven train why would you do that because i was drunk I can't hang out with him. Stan had his shirt off in, in the fucking city Sold field. out City Field. Stan had his That's shirt off. one of the best games I've ever been to. Yo, the night, we were what down. What is it? Yeah, huh? It was Yankees-Mets? What no, is it was it? Mets-Nationals. But the, 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 the Mets, have, oh, they lost today, but 
they were on an eight game winning streak and like they won how much was the tickets? Games. like 20 bucks Really? The thing is, I the Mets. I next time, man. The Mets, Y'all don't even be inviting me nowhere, man. The Mets slash tickets. I'm not tickets. having this conversation. Y'all don't be inviting <laughs> me. I'm not nowhere, having man. this conversation. The Mets cut tickets by 80%. I invite you places. <laughs> Three weeks ago, the Mets were like out of it. Yeah. And the, 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 they, to get people to come to the games, they cut ticket prices by 80%. And then the Mets started winning. So now they're like in contention. They could possibly make the playoffs. But like now tickets are dirt cheap. And it's hilarious. So I went. I, I had, But that's how it should dude, be. Dude, field level seats. But that's how it should for like be, though. Eighteen. I, I, Sabrina got me tickets for my birthday, yeah. and like I already had tickets for the same game in the yeah. same section, basically. So I sold the tickets she got me for like yeah, sixty bucks. It was great. Oh, that's dope. It's a great game, dude. Ninth inning, they're down three, right? And I, t- I turned. I don't he don't watch sports. Dog, it was <laughs> one of the <laughs> greatest games I've ever been to. That's, that's why good. I took my shirt off. It, it got wild. That's great. Listen. I'm hungry, as usual. Let's get out of here. What do you, you want to eat? What, what are you doing today, Sam? I don't know. Uh, laundry. Right. I like what else, wings. What else we got going on? Oh, so people. Uh, I don't know the exact dates, I, uh, but next month I just got it just got announced. I'm gonna be in the Fifth Borough Comedy Festival in Staten Island. Nice. That's uh, what's up. Yeah. Staten Island. So, I'll never go to. Yeah, it's a it's a trip, but uh, if it. you're, I was supposed to go to Fire Island today. That's dope. That's dope. Right? I was supposed dope. to go to Fire Island. So what the ha- what the hell happened? I got what I wanted yesterday. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, but yeah, uh, you follow me at uh, at Funny Man Stand for all the details. Um, and then uh, oh, Jay Moore's agent started following me on Instagram, which is kind of weird. Uh, Be on yeah. the lookout. You on the rise. August twenty uh, seventh, uh, Pine Box Rock Shop. Uh, the Vagina Lounge, I'll be hosting that. And sometime in September, I'll be at Brooklyn House of Comedy. I'm not sure when, but I'll let you know about that. Where are you going to be, Shana? I don't know. Thought I'm everywhere. I was about Thought to and bopping. Hot Girl <laughs> Summer is about to be lukewarm summer <laughs> soon. I'm going back to school. So uh, I'll still be a hot girl. Just hot girl with uh, some studying and books. Lots of books and reading. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm chilling, man. I'm doing me. What were you, where were you at? Some cyber party yesterday or something? Nah, there's a uh, VR. We should go and do that. What? That looked cool. I know. The, though, I was with somebody who knows the guys who had who run that space, but they do like VR shit, and they had like a VR John Wick game. Just oh, fire, bro. No. Just fire. That looks like a. It's like VR ass John game. John Wick, and you're like running around. But we was like playing like. Grand Theft Auto on this big ass projector. Now I want a projector for my house. Like I, I don't want no TV. I like, want a big ass projector. Like, uh, on my wall. like what's his what's, what's his name's uh, TV and on oh. How I Met Your Mother? Barney Stinson. Barney Stinson. You ever watch that show? I love that. How oh, I Met Your Mother. Yeah. Yeah. I love before, that show. Bro. I've seen. No, every but this episode. is this was. They never dope, show his TV, but you always see like like the glow of this big ass wall. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it's probably a projector. Like the projector right, shit yeah. is dope though. Like now the technology is there where it's clear enough. Yeah. Like it's HD quality. And it's not that expensive. Projector. No, it's not. It's the same as a TV. Yeah. So my next house, <laughs> where I move, I'm, yeah. I'm getting a projector. I'm not okay. Gonna Plus it's safe space. No, it's dope, bro. It's dope. It's dope. Is it from from the ceiling or? It was on the ceiling. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay, I'm gonna guys. go to H&M and buy pants. <laughs> All right, bro. There's nobody's moving. You. Thank y'all. You buy so, lunch subscribe. One uh, send us send us email. Let us know what you want to. Um, yes. If you had a specific thing you want to say, if you want to talk about a movie. There's a movie you want us to watch. Yeah. Let us know. We're if doing you good have boys. Re- how about if you have a review? Yeah, if you have a review of this movie, yeah. let us know. We didn't get we'll to read see um, huh? Masterpiece film. <laughs> I got the hookup, oh, too? Up too? Yeah, because we'll wait. It'll be on, it'll be on something. Yeah, real fast. I'm sure some African dude on 26th Street's got it. <laughs> no, if you got Beyonce. CDs, I mean. DVDs, yo, Beyonce. <laughs> you That's Beyonce a classic. Beyonce, too. I need that. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta look up Beyonce too. I gotta buddy, buddy, we don't have the country, the country codes for it to play it on DVDs. Yeah. This girl I'm talking to, she's watching Mr. and Pete right now. Okay. I was, gonna, was like, that was a going good through it. All, All right. right, well, I T S N E L L Z one underscore. Uh, funny man, Stan, all one word. And S P eight ghost. Deuce. <laughs>